All right, we back. Goodfellas Sports TV. I just seen the video of Lil Reese getting jumped. And um, apparently he did shit himself. You know, they were trying to say that's the way the draws is made. But, hey, man, if you want to hear me talk more about it, you want to go check it out, I put it right in the description. Source link. I'm not about to share nothing on YouTube. They cracking down on copyright. But, um, uh, wasn't a way to go out. Put it to you that way. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. It wasn't the ideal way to go out. You know, it didn't look like, I don't know what exactly happened. Um, how he got on the ground, per se, but um, it was one fella, he didn't get his face, he had a, a blue jacket on, like a blue Detroit jacket on, with the orange uh, D, English D, and he was dragging a little Reese by his drawers, and somehow he turned over, and then when he turned over, you kind of see the shit stain, and you're like, okay, it could have been how the drawers is made, is what they saying, and then you look at uh, the dude that's recording his Air Force One, he had some some leakage, from Lil Reese on his shoe, apparently, unless they set it up. And he said, oh, this nigga didn't shit it on my shoe. And he jumps in. So I only like seeing two people, the guy that was recording, and one guy in the blue was beating him up. But, uh, it, you know, he said it was five people. The way they got the camera, angle, you really couldn't see. By the time by the time he started recording, it was just the one dude on his head. You know what I'm saying? The way they got it chopped up. I don't know if they got any more that's going to come out. But he, uh, a girl said, get off of him. And, you know, Lil Reese was telling him to call his peoples. He was like, call them people, call them people. And uh, pretty much once he found out he had, you know, peed or doodled on his shoe, whatever that was on his Air Force One, the guy dragged him by his drawers. Like right there, you see him at the top left-hand corner. He dragged him by his shorts and was just dragging that nigga, man. Dragging him. He was fighting back, though. He wasn't just sitting there, like like, just taking it. He was trying to swing his shit, but he told his, whoever his female companion was, he told her to call those people. So, pretty much, I don't know if they, this is the full video, all they got. You know, I, like I said, I linked in the description under, under source link, or it's going to be under a full video link, whatever. Probably source link. Um, but, it wasn't a good look. You know, it is what it is. You know, but all you can do if you, I mean, I only showed two people jumping on him. He said it was five, so I take him at his word. All you can really do, to be honest, all you can really do is he fought back, you know? He fought back. I mean, at the end of the day, when you had that gangster persona, first thing they're going to say, where your gun was at, I mean, why this happened? He like 100 pounds. He real small dude, you know? But, you know, like I said in my, my original video, man, they just, in my opinion, man, black people got to get over this, man. You know, at the end of the day, just they just doing stuff for clout now. People doing stuff for popularity now. And um, I just don't understand. Now, he told one of the YBI, Neymar, whatever his name was, that he was going to get at him because he was making fun of him. I'm like, how you going to get mad at him when everybody out here making fun of you? You're going to get mad at him. But why don't you get mad at the people who jump and beat you up? That's what be tripping me out. Why you don't get mad at them? You getting mad because this dude on the sideline laughing like everybody else laughing at you. But you want to fight him. No, I'll go get them niggas that just jumped you. Y'all be talking about this gangster and what y'all do and all this shit. No, man, don't get mad at him for making fun of you. At the end of the day, you need to get at them boys who jumped you. You know, but, hey, it's the way the game is today, man. You want to pick on the weak link. <laughs> Real talk. You want to pick on the weak link. You know, the, the YBN, Nate and the Amer, I don't know the dude's name. So many YBN dudes. I don't know his name, but hey, the video out, I put it in the description. Um, it, well, I didn't see five guys jumping. I'm not saying it wasn't there, but it was uh, one guy just, you know, to, you know, dragging him through the fucking uh, the dirt. Other guy recorded, then he jumped in once he found out he had some shit or some, some urine on his shoe. And um, he was calling for help. He told his female companion to call for help. He said, call them boys, call them boys, so... At the end of the day, it is what it is, man. Appreciate everybody for checking out. Once again, I put the full video link in the description. Let me know what you guys think when you watch it. Just go over there. Um, it's right on YouTube. So don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out to the email if you have a business question, a cry response, ship a video request. Continue to share the videos the best way possible. I appreciate everybody for sharing the videos. You want to make a donation, that link's in the description. Check out the Patreon. And um, unfortunate, hopefully, you know, you can get over it. But it is what it is. One time for the one time we got.